Art Club for you. First one is Aurora Beauty. It is a round by Deborah Malcolm and it measures 102 by 51 centimeters. Then I've got a square called Woodland Walk Cottage by Dominic Davison. It measures 105 by 70 centimeters. And I also have Black Cat by Candlelight by Image World. It's a square measuring 99 by 70 centimeters. So let's start with the smallest one in the, in the round, Aurora Beauty. So I have to say, I was a little on the fence with this image. So I didn't get it at the release, but after seeing it done up, I was like, I have to get it. It looks so great. Um, Diamond Art Club toolkits come in this resealable frosted bag and they list the contents in front. But what you're gonna get is a blue diamond painting pen, two pieces of heart-shaped pink wax, a handful of baggies, a clear diamond painting tray with a spout. You get this little blue squishy. And in there, you're also gonna get one of those skinny four placers. So that's your toolkit for the rounds. You'll get this little baby sticker. And then your canvas is gonna come in this plastic sleeve with your drills wrapped around the canvas. Now, Diamond Art Club canvases have this soft velvet-like material that it is self-flattening, but for the sake of time, I am gonna go ahead and roll this out so that flattens a little faster for us to look at. Oh, it's a long one. Okay, let's see if I can, won't be able to fit it on frame, but So here's that. We got the blue step-by-step -step diamond painting instruction brochure, as well as a large inventory sticker sheet. Gives you a better picture of our image. Look at all the purples in it, I love it. So we are working with 49 colors with two ABs. And so once again, this is Aurora Beauty by Deborah Malcolm. Here are our drills. Drills come packed up. We have a label in the front, which makes it easier to store your canvas separate from your drills. These are rounds. I haven't ordered a round in a while. So here's a look at what the color palette looks like. Look at all the purples. I love that. That's amazing. And I think if you can see here, there's a little bit of one of the ABs. Now AB stands for Aurora Borealis, which is basically an iridescent coating that is placed on the drills to highlight it just a little bit more. And it works as an accent on your diamond paintings. They're really fun to work with, but they can be tricky. But it really does make the effect that much better on your diamond paintings. So there you go, there's the drills. Now Diamond Art Club canvases will be branded on the top and they always have two keys on opposite sides of the canvas for you to work with. So here's one key, here's the second key, and then on your lower left hand side will be a thumbprint of your image along with the information for it. Now let's take a close look at the drill field. They do have the guide circles for the rounds. Um, I don't mind them so much. I find that they don't show up as much as you think they do. So you don't really have to place your drills exactly within the circles. And at the end of the day, no one's gonna notice that. They're just gonna be in awe of how gorgeous your painting is. So here it is, various parts of the drill field for you to see. Everything looks pretty clear. And try to fit as much as I can in here. But here it is, Aurora Be Beauty by Deborah Malcolm. I think this is gonna be amazing. Has anyone ever seen the Northern Lights? That's on my bucket list of things to see. But I love how this is. 
with the reflection in the water and it's gonna turn out great. So there you go. Let's go on to the next one. Woodland Walk Cottage by Dominic Davison. So once again, this is a square, it's pretty big, it measures 105 by 70 centimeters. So their toolkits for the square diamond paintings were gonna be exactly like what I showed you in rounds, except the squares get this pair of very pointy black tweezers. So be careful with these, they can get sharp. So that's the toolkit. Here is our baby sticker. And let's get into the canvas. All right. Yeah. I always get them. Looks like we're gonna have two bundles of drills here. how amazing this looks so sorry I know I'm working with a glare I tried playing with the window shades here but to get the glare completely off would mean I'm filming this in the dark so it doesn't quite work but never said I was professional so <laughs> sorry guys so there's that we got our blue brochure we got our big sticker sheet. Here is a better look at our image. I know about you guys, but this is pretty big for a cottage, don't you think? There's like four chimneys. It's like a woodland mansion, but still like it. It's really cool, all the flowers and color around it. Woodland Walk Cottage by Dominic Davison. We are working with 60 colors and it looks like two ABs. So let's look at our drills. I've noticed that they've been trying to bundle their drills into one big bundle lately, but looks like here we've got two. So here's one set. You can see some of the colors for the flowers and plants in here. Here's the second one. The good thing when they do bundle it, they'll have like this two of two or one of two. So you can still kind of keep track of it. I like this bright yellow color. Very happy. And here's one of the ABs here. You can see it kind of sparkling from within these drills. But that's what I mean by... They're kind of meant as highlights for your diamond painting. So there's that. Here's the, is that? No, that's not even an AB. It was just really sparkly. <laughs> so there you go. Here it is yours. And now let's take a look at this canvas. So once again, you got the branding on the top center. You got two keys on both sides. Lower left-hand corner. And then let's look at the drill field. So this is a square canvas. And square canvases, when you look at it raw, meaning with no drills, you can actually see the picture normally pretty clearly. And I think it's because they don't have those little guiding circles that kind of limits the amount of color that shows up on the canvas, if you know what I mean. But they all provide like really great detail, but it's always fun to be able to see your design before you even put diamonds on it. So there you go. Let's see if I can get as much of this into the frame as I can. See that you got some mallard ducks here at the bottom. You got this cute little black and white cat at the front door. You got a squirrel here, didn't even notice him. But I love all the little plant details. And it's so green. This is gonna be fun. This makes 
gives me such a peaceful feeling looking at it. I could just imagine walking down this pathway into the forest. That's so great. If I had a cottage like this, I'd be so happy. <laughs> It'd be fun. But anyways, so there you go. Woodland Walk Cottage by Dominic Davison. All right, now, last but not least, Black Cat by Candlelight. This is by Image World. We got our toolkit. We got our baby sticker. And we got our canvas. It's a big one. I really like this cat series that they're doing. I think this is the second one. So um, it's been really fun. I haven't done one up yet, but I will eventually. Ooh, this cat is a lot bigger than I thought. I don't know what I was expecting, but he is like half of the picture. That's awesome. Wow, he is gonna look amazing. Okay, well, <laughs> let's brochure. Here is a better picture of our image. So once again, Black Cat by Candlelight by Image World. This is a square measuring 99 by 70 centimeters. We are working with 52 colors. Wow. With two ABs. You wouldn't think there would be so many colors because we got this giant black cat here. So I can imagine we're probably in new 10 land for a while. So here's our bundle of drills. This is a square. So whenever I do this, I'm not so much trying to show you guys the quality of the drills just because, I mean, you can kind of see the quality through the baggies, but I've always felt as if you're not really gonna know what the quality is until you start placing them on a canvas anyway. So this is more just to kind of show you the colors that you're getting with this painting. Look at this bright orange. That's awesome. Here's some of the ABs here. And there you go. Now let's look at this canvas. Wow, I'm like blown away by it. I really like it. I like how big the cat is here. He's clearly the focal point of this image with this, it's almost like a fairy tale book. I feel like every like Shrek movie or fairy tale book movie always has a book with this sort of format on it. So to me, that's a fairy tale book. So there you go. We got keys on both sides. Oh, I'm sorry. And then we got lower left hand corner with our thumbprint and, or not, thumbnail in the information. Let's take a look at this. That is a lot of 310, guys. So you got a fair amount of color blocking, which may be fun. If you like color blocking, this could be a painting for you if you're wanting to conquer a big painting, but was always kind of thrown off by the amount of confetti in the big paintings. Because this looks like a fair amount of color blocking with some confetti, of course, to add in the details. But there you go. Black Cat by Candlelight by Image World. Square measuring 99 by 70 centimeters. I'm gonna have to say this is my favorite one out of the three. And I love all three, but yeah. So there you go. Thanks you guys for hanging around. And I always appreciate you. Thank you guys so much. Um, take care everyone and I'll check in with you later. Bye now.